Hello there! This video explains how to use a head gasket tester on a car. Why bother? Because you could find out within minutes whether your gasket is leaking. So, let's have a look at the kit. It includes this transparent plastic tube, this rubber bung connected to the bottom of the tube, this carbon dioxide reaction fluid, and this pipette. It's a weird looking thing, isn't it? Maybe it's technology we stole from aliens. Wait, no, you can't have it back. It's ours now and we're keeping it. Welcome to Car Spy TV. Right, let's take a moment to recap the basics so we understand how a head gasket tester works. The head gasket seals the engine block to the cylinder head. Among other things, it separates the combustible mixture of fuel and air, coolant and oil. So, if the head gasket leaks, carbon dioxide from the combustion process escapes into the engine coolant. This device detects carbon dioxide in coolant. Is that right? Yeah? Good. To get started, make sure the engine is cold so there's very little pressure in the cooling system. Why? Because you have to remove the cap from the cooling system's expansion tank or its radiator. If the engine is warm, there's a lot of pressure in the cooling system and the coolant inside it gets very hot. So, if you remove the cap, coolant can, under some circumstances, shoot out at high speed and burn you. On this car, let's remove the cap from the expansion tank rather than the radiator. Now, insert the head gasket test tube. Next, Put in 2 millilitres of fluid through this hole. The level should be about here. Note too that at the start of the test the fluid is blue. Now start the engine and give it a few revs. You want it to get warm and increase the pressure in the cooling system. Next, let the engine run for about five minutes and every now and then rev it. Okay, five minutes has passed, so let's have a look at the reaction fluid. It's still blue, so the head gasket is fine. If, in contrast on your car, the fluid goes yellow or green, there's a leak and carbon dioxide is escaping into your coolant. OK, we have a few final points to consider. First, head gasket testers come in many shapes and sizes, so yours might look different to mine. However, it probably works on broadly the same principle. Second, if your test confirms there is a leak, the most likely cause is the head gasket, but it could be something else. A cracked engine block, for example. Is that why you're still here? Has your spaceship broken down? Oh dear. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more content, ask any questions in the comment section, and do me a favour and click like on this video. Oh, you might also like to check out my new book. It's called How to Buy the Right Used Car, and it guides you through the entire process. It's available at Amazon, and there's a link in the description of this video that takes you straight to it. Right, that's all for now. Come on then. Let's go and fix your spaceship.